Hey guys, Steph here. I don't think I, I don't know if I did an intro. I don't even remember if I vlogged this morning. I think I did. I think I did. If I didn't, I'm just going to say it again anyways. Today is uh, day 16 of Vlogmas. I haven't posted since day 8, so I'm really behind. Cube is there. Um, we just got done with our white elephant, so I think it went pretty well. I definitely... It's always hard when people don't really want to steal because the whole point of white elephant, right? It goes really fast if people don't want to steal. And there was like, at the end, there was some steal. Like, I stole just to steal. Um, I think I ended up with this umbrella, which I didn't need, but I wanted to steal it just to make the game keep kind of going. But yeah, it was fun. It was like the most random assortment of gifts, you know? Um, there's still some stuff that got left on the table, so I'll hang on to that. But all of this stuff got picked. We had some other gift card things. Garbage bags, Game of Thrones mugs. It's just kind of funny. It was like so random, but fun. And I think it was like a perfect amount of like fun, laughs, steals. It went it went pretty quickly. We were able to do it probably in like 45 minutes, if a, maybe a little bit less. Um, we didn't end up having as many people though. We only ended up with about 20 people and I was uh, predicting 30, so. I think that was one of the reasons why it ended up going quicker. But yeah, it was fun. All right, I'm going to grab a quick bite to eat downstairs, and then I just got to knock out a bunch of uh, work things. So um, yeah, I'll check in with you guys later tonight. Hopefully, if I can get everything done and not be stressed out about it, then I can catch up with my vlogs, mainly the advent calendars. Because again, I have been vlogging every day. I just don't do the advent calendars. I might need to rethink advent calendars because that's the one thing that kind of holds me back from posting all of my stuff, I would say. All right, let's do it. Oh, you guys, my day. <laughs> I just, I'm thinking maybe I need to reverse psychology and go into the day thinking I'm not gonna get anything done and then I'll get a lot of things done, maybe. Uh, I just finished up some work stuff. There's a lot more work stuff I have to do, but I feel like if I keep trying to do it, it's just, it's not going to happen. So I kind of want to adjust my focus to something a little bit different to maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know. Um, I'm watching currently, so this is a, another pokey streamer that I watch. Uh, I streamed it to my TV so I could just be working and not have to stare at my phone. Um, this is, he's royalty gaming. So his prices are real good. He must get his cards not like how I get. Like I get my cards from like the store. He obviously goes through some kind of distributor because he's able to sell, like Vivid Voltage, he only charges $5 a pack, which is unbelievably low. I don't know where he gets his card from. Ooh, I signed up for this. Um, It's like basically like gambling, like a wheel. And the winner gets 36 um, Hidden Fates packs. All right, so here it is. There's a lot of people in this though. It's like 36 people. So the chance of getting it slim. 24 people. Sorry. I guess let's see. I was in a gambling mood tonight. I'm always in a gambling mood. I should stay away. But he does this cool spin wheel. This 36 Hidden Fates packs. That's. Oh my god. That was so close to my name, kind of. But Kirk got it. Congratulations, Kirk. There it goes. Nuts. That's okay. That was a crazy, like I was like thinking about it and I was like, ah, I shouldn't do it because the chances of winning are so slim. But if you win 36 packs of, of Hidden Fates, that's like 700 something dollars. So, um, but yeah, he has pretty good pricing. So I bought a few things from him. I got um, like a couple Hidden Fates, a Shiny Star V, and two, or four Vivid Voltage. Actually, I ended up with eight Vivid Voltage. I got two Amazing Rares, actually, which was kind of great. But they were both uh, Zacyon. I don't even think that's how you say his name. But yeah, oh man. Good job, Kirk. And then I got a Shiny Glaceon, which is not a bad pool. So I need to stop doing it though. I was gonna buy more, but I was like, no, no, no. Cause I never am able, honestly, I rarely can catch this guy live. I always see it afterwards. So I was like really excited that I caught him live. Okay, I'm gonna finish up here. I'm gonna kind of clean up this area cause it's a little bit of a hot mess after our uh, Zoom thing today for work. And then I am going to eat. My mom brought me some food. I'll show you guys. It's just lobster and uh, dylon. It's like the same thing that she always brings me, but I'm down. And then um, I'm hoping I can catch up with my vlogs. I think it'll make me feel better in my life if I can catch up with my vlogs because I'm not gonna say I'm anxious about it. I just feel like I want to be doing it. I just don't have the time or I'm not, 
I'm not produce like I'm not putting any energy towards it and so that's a thing that's like hurting my soul so I think maybe if I do that maybe my soul will kind of feel a little bit better and I'll be more successful in everything across the board I also want to put together my advent calendar for my Pokemon cards which I'm already behind on but um, I can still do it why not all right let's get to it remember I was telling you guys um, a couple days ago that cube when he walks on these things he like doesn't really get it it's funny watching him try to like maneuver around. He's like very cautious about walking on the grate. <laughs> he like doesn't know. I totally just signed up for a pack battle, but it's one of those like ones that like you pay and if they they grate like they do the value of the cards and whoever has the highest value gets all the cards. So I'm not doing well. And the first guy pulled a gold card, so it's probably it's like we're not gonna win, but that's okay. It's still fun to watch. Nothing, nothing. So not looking too good, because that was the second round. So there's only four more packs left. It's six, six packs per person. Oh, Ooh. the guy after me got an Aegislash. Not the greatest though, but the other guy got a gold orangutan or whatever, orangut something. And that's worth like $30, so. I'm hoping that maybe I can get lucky and get like the full art Pikachu V. That's like the second best card in the set. Or like an amazing rare, but that would be really lucky. That'd be really lucky. You could actually make it better if you just didn't get anything because then you wouldn't feel like you lost something, right? Like if I got an amazing rare now, that'd be sad because I'm gonna lose it. I wouldn't be able to um, compete with the gold card. Let's see. Ooh, is it good? Did it? Do you think? I don't know. Now I want to look. Now, everyone always, whenever I do these pack battles, they all think I'm a guy. It's so funny. I mean, it's. I feel like it's all guys mainly that watch these things and, and participate in these things. But it's kind of funny. Cardless. Yeah, if somebody gets the hyper rare Pikachu, then it's over. Let's see if I can get lucky and get uh, like the peak or not the Pikachu. The Pikachu would be great, but the um like an am amazing rare or something. So this is me. Let's see. Nothing. I'm trying to see if I can get him to send me all the reverse hollows because I need so many reverse hollows from this set and I don't know. Like I was like, can I pay you for you to ship me? Like I'll pay for the cards and you can ship me them. But we'll see. We'll see. I don't know. I'm going to see if I can work out a deal with them because that's the thing. Like, I haven't opened up that many Vivid Voltage packs, and so it's hard because, like, they're, they're hard to get. And then I've, I've done some on my pack breaks. That's why I've been trading cards with people. But, yeah, like, I would love to get, um, I would love to get uh, all the reverse hollows. That'd be amazing. Let's take a look at this just to see. So, I just got the full art bit. Oh, wait. 2275 so that's not it's like help me but it's not gonna be what did he have he is a gold like I think it's a ring or something is it that one 27 so I'm five dollars short so I definitely need I definitely need something else pretty good so I don't know and if this guy gets the amazing rare then Okay, so there's still a chance. There's, a, I think there's one more amazing wear floating around. So if I can get that, that might help me out. But let's see. No. Okay, so I'm probably gonna lose that, which is okay. I'm okay with losing the the bay card. Is that what it's called? Um. Oh. Oh. What do you get? What do you get? Oh. I don't know, sir. Wait. I don't know what that's worth. Whoever gets this, basically whoever gets this last amazing rare is going to be like, I think is going to be the one who takes it. Galarian Surfetch, $4. And I didn't get anything else. Like, that's the problem, right? If I'd gotten like three other just like normal cards that were worth like three to six dollars, that would definitely help me. But yeah, and because he also got the Toga Kiss, which I don't think is worth a lot. Toga. 
2.30. So, let's see, last round, last round. Whoever, hopefully the Amazing Rare doesn't go to somebody who doesn't have anything, because that wouldn't be great. If it goes to this guy, then we're done. We're done. Well, I don't think that that's going to help him too much, but again, it just depends. I feel like right now with the board, I'm the only one, unless somebody gets the, the full art Pikachu V or the or the um, hyper rare Pikachu, then the guy on the right's going to win. I might be able to beat him if I get the amazing rare, but most likely I'm not. He lost his Steelix. This is so intense. Come on, guys. Let's see. Like, if this guy gets the Amazing Rare, it's going to suck because he's automatically going to lose it because he doesn't have anything else. Oh, okay, you guys. I need this Amazing Rare. <laughs> this is so intense. I need the Amazing Rare because I'm the only one that has another card on the board that can even compete. That's worth 22 and he's right. worth 27. I need the amazing rare. No! I'm out. I'm out. Dang it. So somebody else can get amazing rare. And I don't think that they're going to be able to compete. This guy, this guy needs, this guy needs the amazing rare. He will beat him if he gets the Amazing Rare because he has another Amazing Rare. If you pull an Amazing Rare or a Rainbow Rare, you pretty much seal the deal. Oh, it's not! No! Dang it. So, Ants, will it really be the last pack Amazing Rare? I see it. This guy's gonna snipe. We didn't get. Oh, man. The box only got one Amazing Rare. That sucks. That sucks. I didn't even know there was booster boxes with only one amazing rare. Okay, so that first guy won. That was fun. I would totally, I can't do that all the time, but I would totally do that again. That was fun to watch. The guy, the first guy who went definitely won. Fun times. Okay, I need to keep, I'm editing a vlog here. I need to keep doing that. I just got vivid voltage packs. Ooh. All right, somebody already pulled the full art Pikachu V, so that's not on the table, but maybe... Um, like a secret rare would be cool. We'll see. Questionable. But I did ask him to keep all my reverse hollows and amazing rares, so hopefully at least I'll get some of those. Oh man, these are cold. Yeah. Yeah. Boo. Man, I'm not getting good packs at all. I need to stop. Cold, 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 cold. Last pack. Let's see. Nothing. That was bad. That's a sign that I need to stop. Okay, I'm going to keep editing vlogs. Ugh. You guys, I lost track of time. It's so late. Um, I just let the cats outside so they can run around a little bit before bed, but I'm going to eat. So my mom brought the veggies that I'm going to put some oyster soy sauce. And then she actually made lobster, which is, my mom just likes to buy lobster sometimes. And she, uh, she cleans it and then she drops me off some lobster. So I'm going to be eating lobster. Uh, I have fresh squeezed lemon juice. And there's Mac. Oh, Mac wants to go outside. Yes. So I'm not your typical... Asian person who likes to eat all the brains and stuff out of the head, but this lobster has like eggs in it, which is different. Sorry for people who are grossed out by this, but they're actually not bad. It's like fish eggs, but in a lobster. I don't usually get that very often.